Nope, we're gonna spice it up. We are gonna get more pizzazz in here. No, nope. more pizzazz. Oh no! Freaking zip ties. These are in Spanish. Ah! Is that wide enough? Nope, not, wow, not even close. Okay. Is that wide enough? Yes, it is. Okay, very good. Oh no, why'd I do that? There we go. Doesn't this look lovely? Oh, please be wide enough. It's, oh God, it's not wide enough. Uh, okay, it's fine, it's fine. Alright, well, this is gonna have to do. <laughs> that looks fantastic! I am very happy with that. It took so long I had to get a different mug though, and by that I mean it's now a different day. Hello friends. Have you guys seen that Tumblr post that was floating around for a bit where it said um, go on YouTube and type in school project and just see what comes up because it'll give you an evening of entertainment? Well I did that and I must say that statement's a little bit overrated. But I did find a couple of gems and I want to, um, I don't know, very harshly critique them because I come from a film background and my school projects were actually pretty good back in the day, not gonna lie. But on that note, it's not fair for me to like roast a bunch of kids school projects without showing at least one of mine first just to kind of just to level the playing field a little bit. So uh, let's roll it. And by roll it, I mean I'll, I'll slot it in when I'm editing this later. This holiday season. Hey, I gotta show you something. Relatively based on the Academy Award winning best selling novel, Save the Little Reptiles Everyone Loves. Yeah, see, I got some friends I look after at this old house here. Yeah? Yeah. What the f? Dude! That was one of my lizard friends! Well, I didn't know! I didn't- I didn't see it! From the people that brought you holes. How could you not see him? He's right there! Oh my gosh, he smushed in everything! And because of Winn-Dixie... Oh, poor baby. <laughs> Way to go. Way to go. That's one less lizard that I love and care about. Well, what's the deal with this place anyway? Okay, well, there's these these mean big guys that want to tear down this house, and and the, that includes this porch, which is full of little lizard critters that I care about. Stand up for what you believe in. No! We will not let you kill these lizards! Ow! Hoot. Lizard edition. Oh, oh man, that's crazy. So cringe, man. I was so young and it looks so bad compared to the things I do now. I don't even know what I'm gonna show yet. Hey there, real quick, this is editing Mike here for just a hot second. Um, I didn't know what I was gonna show like I just said, but now I obviously do and I haven't watched that video in a very long time, so I would like to formally retract my statement of what I said earlier when I said that my video projects were actually pretty good because that was not very good. That was that was very bad, in fact, and I, I, I am cringing now. I was playing it up for the camera just a second ago, but now now I am cringing and I, I might die from that. So if, if you may never see this and if you don't, it's it's because I'm dead. All right, now the playing field is leveled. Let's look at a couple of these that I found. School project, we got a 92 out of 100 because it wasn't school appropriate. And since this is the thumbnail, yeah, probably. Praise the Lord, get in the name of the Lord. Oh, it's a beautiful day. I gotta brush my teeth. Where the f is Dominic? Where the f is Dominic? I want Dominic now! Where the f is Dominic? 23 seconds in is the most obnoxious thing I've ever seen. Is that oh, Dominic? Maybe. <laughs> 16 year old me has been there, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Guys, where are we going? Okay. Guys, let's just have someone sing like Amazing Grace or something in the background and we'll we'll just have it over top of the whole thing. It'll be funny. Oh god. Ah, cr ah great. That's that's what I get for being a douchebag. Alright, that 
guy's name is Alex. He skateboards a lot. He started smoking weed at the age of 11. And his idea of funny is to be really obnoxious in public and get in everyone's way and just think it's hilarious. Want to like Alex. <laughs> Told you he skates. Oh, come on. I hated these kids in high school, dude. I think that some people thought I was a part of, of these kids in high school because I looked like this. But like, it's not, it, it, was, it was never really funny to me. It's just always been, really, are we doing this? We're gonna be this immature. Anyway, it's not like the rest makes any sense anyway, so. 92 out of 100 because what was it over? I give it a 2 out of 100 just because I, I hated that. My one big question with this video as a school project is, like, what, what was the assignment? <laughs> I mean, this just looks like another Saturday to these kids. What could they have possibly been assigned that they got a 92 out of 100 on, and the only reason that they lost 8 points was because it wasn't school appropriate? Public education's dead. And let's see what else we got here. This next one is just called Coke Commercial School Project. From 2009, I might add, so this is like, this is old YouTube. Oh, I can't stand that. <laughs> We're off to a rocky start here, man. I can't stand the om nom crunch munch close up of someone's face. It makes my skin crawl. <laughs> that too is how I, I go to drink a Coke. I just, ah, crap. There has got to be some in there somewhere. Oh yes, dude, the classic airsoft gun. If you got into filmmaking at a very young age and you're, especially if you're a guy, there is always that one video you made where you're just like, you know what? We're gonna make an action movie. We're gonna use my airsoft guns. They look real, dude. They look, I mean, it's got the orange tip, but we could, we could like spray paint it. We'll make it look real. And like, people will think we're so cool and not like a bunch of nine year olds. <laughs> and like, no shade to this kid, but like, that's, <laughs> that, that's not too far off from the actual train of thought that you think when you're making this video at such a young age. It's just funny. I don't know what it is about old YouTube, but I swear they were like, you, you had like four sound effects on, on the whole internet to choose from and like the same music too. Okay, real quick. What is it about old YouTube that always uses Paralyzed by Finger Eleven? In like every tutorial video and like anything that opens up with like the Windows Movie Maker blue screen with the white text and there's like some in the foreground and it's kind of going the other way in the background. You, like every time you click on a video, it's just, I don't even know that song. I never, I never even listened to Finger Eleven. I only know that song because of old YouTube. Uh, dude, if that pops up at the end during the credits or something, I'm gonna destroy this screen. I don't know. The death, why is it that when you're when you're nine and you're trying to make an action movie, the friend never died, right? It was always like, dude, you gotta commit, you gotta like, you gotta hit that ground, man. You're dying. You can't like lower yourself down with your arms. You're not you're not doing push-ups here. You're dying. <gasps> Bend 
I could just see them getting those car shots, like the kid asking his little brother, like, Hey Dylan, can you drive your car just, just, just out the driveway and down the street a little bit and then just come right back so we can film it? Once again, I'm not throwing shade or hating or anything. I just see a video like this and it just takes me back to when I was making videos when I was a kid. I, I can't believe it. This is like a one minute video and I got hit with so much nostalgia. Honestly, it... 10, 10 out of 10, because that's that's just a, such a classic example of a kid that's getting into filmmaking and like this is what they came up with. And you look back on it and you cringe a little bit, but you laugh a lot because the memories are good. This next one is called, this is a school project, don't watch it. <laughs> We're gonna watch it. Different. Boring. Hell. <laughs> Alexis is keeping it real. Hell. Fuck. Did that make it in? I need to know. Did they bleep it out? Did they have a version where they bleeped it out and then one where they didn't, that's the one they upload to YouTube? Interesting. Education. Interesting. Boring. Fuck. Okay, Andre. You probably just saw the other girl do hers and now you want to be an edgelord. Annoying. Oh, yeah. Everlasting. <laughs> Lame. Fun. I want to be Josh's friend. But not all schools are bad. Yes, they are. Here's some benefits of our beautiful school. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that little laugh at the end. <laughs> Oh god, honestly, the slow walkers, dude. I'm, I'm, I'm 6'3 and have very long legs, so any kind of slow walker, I'm just like, get out of my way! Now I'm gonna go around and ask people how they feel about, like, Chini on a scale of 1 to 10. 1 being terrible, 10 being... great. Oh, dude, 10. I... <laughs> There was not a piece of me that cared about school at all. I had absolutely zero moral compass when it came to school honesty and all that. I just, yeah, listen up, Harrison High School. I cheated my way through high school. I still graduated with a two seven. Six. Say five. Five or a six? A four. Five. Three. Seven. Uh, two. Because this is a This Is Me project. Okay, I was wondering about that too. This Is Me project. But she's doing it like on school, so. I guess I'm gonna have people describe me in one word, which is terrifying. But I mean, let's see. Beautiful. Beautiful. Sorry. Intelligent. Fun. <laughs> she was holding. <laughs> she was talking into the thing. I'm sorry, I don't know why I thought that was so funny. Like, extravagant. Fun. Sarcastic. Caring. <laughs> Not for you, though. Caring. Outgoing. You're fantastic. Oh, there it is. There's the high school right there. That's the girl that's like kind of in with the popular kids, but she's also pretty cool to everyone. That's the vibe I was getting. I was also getting the vibe of, oh crap, my This Is Me project is due today for last period. I'm gonna throw it together <laughs> throughout the school day and then like assemble it on like some editor on my phone and have it ready by the end of class. That's the kind of student that I was. Hey, can you not interrupt while I'm filming? Okay, I'm, I'm filming a video right now. Next one. This is called The Controlling Boyfriend. Some important messages going on up here. There's an ad on this video. <laughs> what? It, it has 1.2 million views. What in tarnation? How do the algorithm pushed the heck out of this video? Holy crap. Okay, good. You know what? I, I res That was a good looking intro. It may have been a template. I don't know, but I don't know. That was a good first impression. That was the sickest game of hacky sack I've ever seen. I don't know, man. I've seen better. Shit. I agree with JR. Hey, do you know the new girl? Who? Julia? No, she's kind of cute, dude. And I guess so. Yeah, dude, go get her Snapchat. No, or no. Honestly, first impression, or second, I guess, since the intro was the first one, not perfect, but that color grading, not too bad. Yo, I can get her Snapchat. Can't. That's child's play. So I'll, I'll go get it right now. Go get it right now. You can hashtag count on. Snapchat. Go. Okay. Here you go. Yes, that is what I do with my friends when I'm excited. Ah!
No! Oh, gee, I need to get a better solution than that. Okay, that reflector is officially not doing anything. I was gonna keep rolling with it. JR, I'm just not ready for this. Like, we've only been dating for 47 days. We've been dating for 47 days, 22 hours, 23 minutes, 24, 25 seconds. If you're ready for this. No, like, I just, I know that I can't do it. Like, I'm just, I'm not ready. Like, what? I thought we were in love. I mean, you have to see it from my side, too. I think you're ready. No, JR, I'm not ready. Listen, you're ready, okay? Okay. Oh, God, I know it's just the video when they're acting, but that kind of thing just. Even just seeing it acted, it's like so hard to watch. Oh my gosh, hey Abigail! Oh my gosh, hey, I have not seen you in so long! Oh my gosh, hey Abigail! Just sitting here on this curb in this empty parking lot? I didn't see you there! You've been spending all of your time with JR! I know, he just- Dude, whose caddy is that? Wait. Or he only wants to get to hang out with him. That's really- Oh, it's that old guy's okay. I was like, there's only a couple cars in there. It's definitely one of these kids that they're- that are filming. And I'm like, whose daddy got them a caddy? <laughs> whose daddy caddy is that? <laughs> it's really not okay. That doesn't seem healthy. No, it's just because like we have like a really intense love and it's just- I read one, t one time that like love is always supposed to hurt, so no, like love is not supposed to hurt. Dude, people out here really believe in that though. <laughs> I read somewhere that love is always supposed to hurt. If it's not painful, if it's not hurting you to your to your core, then you're, you're not in love, man. Find something else. Thank you for coming to my TED talk. I just wear makeup around my friends. Even later than later than later than later than later that day. <laughs> you trying to make me jealous? Yeah, that's not even a thing. It's I'm not a thing, then why do you do it? So wrong I give you so much attention. I don't what do you want? No. Look. Don't be this guy. This is the camera guy right here. I know a filmmaker when I see one, that guy's a filmmaker. This is an abusive relationship. Julia's gotta get out. What do you want from me? What do you want? I wanna break up. We're done. Mm, he was kind of funny until that. That was pretty cool. This was, okay, this was definitely the situation where the popular kids getting grouped up all together, but then there was the one kid that they don't hang out with, but the one kid that they don't hang out with is like, hey, I, I make videos all the time, like I can make this really good, and like we'll get a good grade on this project, and like everyone's in there like, whoa, dude, like you were kidding, you're really good at this. I know, because I was that kid a lot in high school. But that's all I got for this video. I didn't have to plug my shirt brand anymore because I'm wearing it right here. Just kidding, yeah, I do. This is my shirt brand, Shirts I Guess. Go to shirtsiguess.com, pick up a shirt. The logo shirts uh, without the website underneath are available at a little bit of a discounted rate since it's basically advertising for me. So go to shirtsiguess.com, get a shirt, or don't. Do me a favor, do me a quick favor right now. Leave, leave a like, cause I'm trying to grow, trying to grow this thing, baby. Likes are a great way for the YouTube algorithm to, to get these suckers out. So, um, get this sucker out, smash the like button, subscribe to the channel. I like to have a lot of fun here. I'm, I'm actually trying to upload more consistently now, like this time for real, for real. I, I like doing this. I would venture to say I love doing this. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.